Art and All, Season 1, The Three, A Sniper, A Citizen, and A Journalist. Today, I am with you, Dr. Imane Tahawi. I am a cardiology consultant and recently a genocide researcher. I am honored to meet my guest and your guest, uh, Mr. Robert McNeil. He is a UNESCO artist, ambassador, and uh, ambassador for Remembering Srebrenica UK. He is a former forensic technician. He is an author, and finally, he is a narrator. Welcome, Mr. Robert. Thank you, Dr. Aman. It's a pleasure to speak to you again. Welcome. Uh, going directly to the painting of the day, uh, I, I, I advise um, to start directly uh, with your speech first, because people are coming to uh, uh, listen to uh, you. And uh, uh, I, uh, let us start with your description of the painting of the day. Okay. Uh, well, this painting is called Lens Flare. Um, and I, I, I picked this image or the image of the, the man and the young girl um, from photographs that I had seen on the internet of people in, uh, in Syria uh, who, were, who, who were suffering very badly through bombing and shelling and snipers. And, um, and I found it a very moving picture of a young man um, trying to save the life of a, a, a young girl, a Muslim girl, who had been injured in an explosion. Um, and I, it struck me when I, I looked at the picture that this image uh, was very similar to images that, um, that you see, I, I'm sure, in every war affecting civilians. And, um, and because I have a, a great interest in the wars in the, the Balkans, um, I transferred the background of, 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 of Syria um, into Sniper Alley in Sarajevo, where uh, thousands of, of innocent people were shot and killed by snipers. And, um, and so in, in the painting, you can see behind you in the background, uh, you can maybe just make out, because it's very misty, uh, and that's deliberate. You can see uh, a warning sign saying Patsy Sniper, that's to warn people about snipers. And you can also see a building that's almost destroyed. Um, and that building was bombed every single day during the siege of Sarajevo from 1993, 1992 to 1995. Um, and but nevertheless, the, 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 it was the press office for the, the Sarajevo newspaper, um, and the, the 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 journalists in that that, that building managed to produce a, a newspaper or a news sheet at least every single day almost. And um, but they had to do it in the basement because of the constant shelling of the building. And the point of uh, uh, one of the points of this this painting also was to describe um, uh, to talk a bit about uh, about journalism in war zones and uh, in, in another image uh, of highlighted blood in the, the the painting you can see this now and uh, and that's given me the title of the painting called Lens Flare which is where a journalist taking photographs, um, seeing terrible sights and uh, uh, puts um, these blood spatters on the lens of the camera to demonstrate that, um, that journalists face terrible danger when they're in war zones. And, and this was inspired by a war correspondent called Mary Colvin, a famous uh, investigative journalist who uh, who was killed in, in Homs, I believe, uh, in Syria uh, in February 2012, along with her cameraman. Um, and so I, I just wanted to highlight the, the dangers of, uh, that, that journalists face to bring us images of, of, of what they see. Um, and so you can see a picture of uh, Marie Colvin and her, uh, and her photographer 
who who were sadly killed, bringing us the news that's that that's that, that's needed for everyone in the world to hear what goes on in these places, um, and so that that was really one of the the main points of the the painting. Yes, it was a, a difficult time for uh, Bosnia and for uh, Syria. It is still ongoing more than 10 years. Um, and thank you for uh, your uh, uh, for your painting and for remembering uh, victims here and there and elsewhere in this world. To add something about uh, this uh, painting for us? Um, not really, um, in man. I, I, um, I, I just as I say, I just repeat that I wanted to highlight the, um, the, 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 the problems that journalists have trying to report because it's vitally important that, that these journalists uh, are able to get these, some of these terrible images out to. Uh, especially to politicians in other countries to um, to make them understand that perhaps they could do more to try and stop what's going on, not just in Syria, in Ukraine, but in other parts of the world also. So the, the painting is really a tribute to, um, to journalism. Oh, yes, this is right. And uh, the, finally, uh, thank you for uh, time and uh, for uh, uh, sharing uh, this painting with uh, uh, our uh, audience. And uh, thank you. Thank you, Dr. Aman. Welcome, sir.